Hello everyone. Today is Saturday, February 5th, 2022. South Kivu, 33 rebels, including three warlords, killed by the army in Uvira. This article is taken from 7 Sur 7. A total of 33 Mai Mai militiamen allied with the Burundian rebels of the FNL and Red Tabara were killed by the armed forces of the Democratic Republic of Congo, FARDC, in Uvira, in the province of South Kivu. And I think this is just south of where the joint operation of the Ugandan forces and the FARDC, the uh, DRC forces, operate, uh, because if I'm not mistaken, they operate in North Kivu, whereas this is in South Kivu. Nonetheless, this is near the, I believe, the Rwandan border, uh, the Burundian border, actually, and I think it just said it, the Burundian border. And in case you didn't know, I, I didn't know until I looked it up, because I always wondered where Burundi and, and uh, Rwanda were, because they're like twin countries. They're, excuse me, they're both very small, relatively small countries. But anyway, you have the DRC in the center. You have Zambia right here. DRC borders Zambia. This is Katanga, just to let you know about the geography that, and the topography. Uh, they, this is a, a copper belt. Uh, Zambia is known for copper. And right here in southeastern uh, DRC is known for copper as well and diamonds. And then along, this is the border, you know, the, of the eastern border of Congo. And then over uh, going to the center, the eastern border, you have Burundi. And then right uh, north of that, you have Rwanda. And then north of that, you have Uganda. And then it comes around here. And then uh, it's basically, uh, and I think it borders uh, South Sudan as well. Uh, toward the north, uh, just just due north, straight north. But anyway, uh, this is happening. Obviously, it's not where I would assume that the Ugandan forces would be near Burundi, but this is near the uh, Burundian border. In a statement made to the press this Friday, February 4th, 2022, Lieutenant Mark Elongo Kiondwa, spokesperson for the army in this region, indicates that these militiamen were killed during a large-scale operation carried out by the army from Wednesday 2nd and Thursday 3rd, February 2022, in the village Katanera. Among these neutralized rebels, there are three warlords, according to the details provided by the Congolese army. This operation was carried out under the command of Brigadier General uh, Ramazani Fundi, sector commander. It was in Luako 1 and Luako 2. The report shows 33 neutralized enemies including three leaders, namely Gadi, Lunyuki, and Muyola, he explained. I would assume that this operation by the brilliant DRC, I'm assuming soldiers, uh, they, uh, it was preceded by an intelligence uh, operation. I'm just guessing. It just feels like it. 33 people killed, that's a lot. And then three of whom were warlords, were, were leaders. The spokesperson for the Army Operational Sector, Sukola II, South, South Kivu, informs that deep operations continue and everything is under control of the loyal army. He thus calls on the population to calm down and to disassociate themselves from the armed groups. It should be noted that since the beginning of this year, 2022, clashes between local and foreign armed groups, but also the, with the loyal army have been recurrent in the southern part of South Kivu, particularly in Uvira and Fizi.